Welcome to Technical Studies. In this video, I will show you three simple methods to fit up a 90 degree elbow on a free pipe. Before we start, I have a small question for you why does the flange go out of square after tack welding? The answer is given at the end of the video. Let's begin the tutorial. First, check if the elbow is exactly 90 degrees and the faces are level. Place the elbow on a flat, level plate. Correct the verticality of one face and put small packings underneath so the elbow doesn't rotate. Now check the other face, if the elbow is good, the right angle will touch both sides evenly. Use a large right angle, as shown, to confirm that the elbow is exactly 90 degrees. Also, check the ovality of the elbow ends. Fit up method 1, using clamps and scale. Place the pipe on stands. In this method, the level of the pipe is not very important, but keeping the pipe level is always a good practice. Check that the pipe end is square. Fix the clamps on the pipe, or tack weld them lightly. Insert the elbow into the clamps, and place a gap rod in the joint. Tighten the clamps slightly. Check the overlap around the joint, at least at four points, 90 degrees apart, and always correct the inside overlap first. If the gaps are correct on both sides, tighten the clamps a bit more and tack weld on the sides. To check the top level of the elbow, place a steel scale on the top surface of the elbow, holding it firmly. Measure the distance from the top of the pipe to the bottom edge of the scale at two points. If needed, rotate the elbow up or down until both measurements are equal. Then tack weld at the top and bottom of the joint. It's a good practice to recheck the level and dimensions after tack welding. Fit up method 2 using spirit level. In this method, the level of the pipe is very important. Clean the elbow faces and correct the pipe end as before. Level the pipe perfectly, then place the elbow and the gap rod. Adjust the overlap and gap and tighten the clamps. Tack weld both sides of the joint. Now place the spirit level on top of the elbow and recheck the level of the pipe. If both are correct, tack weld at the top and bottom of the joint. Fit up method 3 using right angles. Place the pipe on stands. Put the clamp and gap rod in position. Correct the gap and overlap and tighten the clamp. Tack weld both sides of the joint. Now place a right angle on top of the elbow and another on top of the pipe, as shown. Bring both right angles closer until they touch smoothly. If the gap between both right angles is equal, the alignment is correct. Then tack weld the top and bottom sides of the joint. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked this video. Please subscribe, like, and comment to support the channel. And the answer to the question at the beginning, the flange goes out of square because single side tacks cause uneven contraction. Always use for tacks at 90 degrees before the final check. How many of you got the correct answer? Let me know in the comments.